Hello. This is my second video. I have a lot of information to share with you and there will be many more videos. But I'll encourage you to look at my number one video first, all right, to understand this one better. In this one, I'm going to show you how Christian mantra meditation is hypnosis. Right, that's a serious subject. All right, now what did Columbia University find? They found that 30% of Americans can be hypnotized. And after hypnosis, what has happened in their brains? Now, in our frontal lobe, in here, in the front, there are two areas. One is called the anterior cingulate cortex, or the ACC. That is responsible for the will, the strength of your will, your determination. There's another part in the front called the lateral frontal cortex, and that is what I'll, I'll call LFC now. LFC is responsible for your sense of reality. Now, in our brain, both ACC and LFC are always working together, functioning together. When they have succeeded in hypnotizing someone, they found that either reality is switched off or the will is switched off. So they both should be on, but if the will is switched off, they're hypnotized. Or if reality is switched off, they're hypnotized. Now, in Christian mantra meditation, as long as the mantra is repetitive for a long time, what happens is this. In your brain, as you repeat the mantra, what you're encouraged to do is to keep all incoming information, data, away from your brain. Let nothing come in so that your mind is blank or empty or void, that you are in a silent space where there is no thought. And this goes on for hours, sometimes for days. Now, when that happens, scientist Andrew Newberg, Dr. Andrew Newberg said, when you deny all information coming into your frontal lobe, it goes offline or it goes quiet. And at that time, the parietal lobe goes down. Dr. Jacobs also said the frontal lobe goes offline. Now, when the frontal lobe goes offline, in other words, it goes quiet, the whole frontal lobe goes quiet, what happens? Is the ACC, which is your will, still working? No, it's switched off. Is LFC, which is responsible for reality, is it on? No. It's switched off. When both ACC and LFC are switched off or go offline, you are hypnotized. And so this scientist, Andrew Newber, said that meditation, whether it's Christian or Hindu or yoga, it doesn't matter. Meditation or Tibetan, meditation is self-hypnosis. That's the other kind of um, hypnosis where someone hypnotizes you with a with a swinging watch that is hip, only 30 percent of people are hypnotizable in self hypnosis 100 percent of people are hypnotizable so if you're doing even christian meditation you are self hypnotizing now is that dangerous when you are hypnotized what happens is this you're open to suggestion all right if you're a man and under hypnosis, someone suggests to you, you're a woman. You are so open that you believe you're a woman. So when you are self-hypnotizing, when you've hypnotized yourself, your mind is so open that it is open to all kinds of suggestion. Your friends can suggest things to you. Your meditation group can suggest things to you. Evil agencies can suggest things to you. Now, how dangerous is that? So for Christians, don't do repetitive mantra meditation. What you need to do is biblical meditation. And I will, in a video, I will explain to you Psalms 19, how King David meditated. And when King David meditated, he was not emptying his mind. He was filling his mind full of the great things of God. So I want to encourage you to keep watching. Come to my website. We have massive amount of details. Details of Columbia University's study on the brain, 
in detail so that you can absorb this for yourself. Bye.